With two out, Frank Robinson lines and hits the left. It bounces off the wall on the first hop for a double. Chacon trots on home with the first run of the ball game. And that's the first Baltimore hit of the game. On a three and two count, Frank hammers a long drive to right center that falls between Willie Davis and Ron Farrell. Robbie races around the third for an easy triple. Now let's see what... Here's a drive to left. It's... Trap. It is a base hit. Leon Jones trapped the ball. That's the first hit for the Orioles. This new delivery. Base hit to left field by Frank Robinson. Fumbled momentarily. Robinson is holding, though. So the Orioles have... Oh, my goodness. Where is this going to come down? Oh, my. Upper deck home run for Frank Robinson. His 13th. Let's see where the usher picks this one up. Somebody in the upper deck is after it. It hit about on the fourth row, I believe. Here's another long blast out to the left field corner. And it's a home run for Frank Robinson, 335 feet away down the left field line. There's a long drive deep to right center field. Blanchard sprints back, but the ball is into the bleachers for a three-run home run. Cincinnati fans take renewed hope and feel they're back in the game as Blassingame and Casco trot home. Stretch to the belt. Kicks and fires. Here's a line drive. Left field way. Pulled. Just inside the line and fair. Gets by Mangual a bit. Powell racing around third. Powell coming home. The throw home by Bando. Powell. Five ball deep to right field. The who back. It's a home run. There he goes. Here's a run. Buford's on the way to third. Now a classic example of a hit and run. Frank Robinson to right field. Blair will hold it second. And Frank rips into this one. Tommy Davis going back. But it's gone. It's in there for a home run. Russ Snyder rounds third base and trots on home with a first run of this 19th play this year after being named Rookie of the Year in 1956. Beaumont, Texas youngsters among the leaders in both batting averages and home runs so far this season. Here goes the runner and a fly ball to right field. Back goes Frank, still going. He leaps and makes the grab. And see if they get the double play. Here comes Louie back. He makes it back to first. Fine catch by Frank Robinson. He's holding.
Flip. And there's a base hit to right center. Reggie throws it in. And the Orioles have the lead man on in the fifth inning. Lonborg had retired. Second. And there goes another one. And this will give him the leadership in home runs in the American League. And the Birds a 2 nothing edge over the Red Sox. Number 18. Drysdale fires and Robbie blasted deep to left. It's a home run. A tremendous drive of 410 feet. That's number two for Robbie in the series. He topped the majors with 49 during the season, and Dodger pitching hasn't been able to slow him down a bit. <laughs> Nothing funny about that. Miller and his follow-through was desperately trying to, you know, either make a play or get out of the way. And Frank Robinson second. In the fifth inning, the National League seems on the way again when Robinson opens with a single. Well, let's watch the left fielder Weiger. He says, forget it, it's gone. Frank Robinson's 30 second a home run of the year and the birds make it six to three. My goodness what a blast. Oh my goodness. Well that one went about 440 feet and the fourth run is in and Frank now has his 33rd home run. Taking advantage of it. that ball is really tagged. And it's out of here. Home run. Four. There they drive by Frank Robinson sinking in the right center. And Robinson now has had three singles and four times out. That ball's out of here. And it's a two to one ball game. So Frank Robinson when the Orioles were trailing nothing to three in the first game hit a home run to make it three to one. Really put the wood to that one. That's his second homer of the series. Two balls one strike. Ground ball base hit up the middle. So Frank Robinson refuses to bend. And scored the lone Oriole run. Well, that's in the hole, the left field, and Frank with his second hit and his fourth hit in the series. So both Frank and Clemente have four hits in this series so far. And he hit a curve. Designated hitter Robinson helps manager Robinson win his first ball game with a home run in his first time at bat. How about that? Right fielder Robinson back. He, I don't know whether he got it or not. I think he may have it, but let's see. He's out of the ballpark. We'll wait for the official ruling on it. Now Hawk is going to remember home runs by Bob Gibson and Mickey Lolich. There's a long belt by Robinson. Forget that one. It's gone. Nobody moved in the mid outfield or infield. Robinson slams it into deep left center, and the Orioles lead three to nothing. And this is the kind of hitting that the Orioles had all year until September 7th when they went into a team batting slump during. There's a long belt to deep center going. And that one is gone. and radio there's a high drive in the deep left way up that one is going and it is gone a home run for Frank Robinson he's got a drive deep to right field that ball is going it is gone a home run
Curtin, they talk about place hitting. Check Powell at first, delivers. Fly ball, well hit, deep left field. It is going to be the 500th home run of a brilliant major league career. Frank Robinson has done it.